must save her. My daughter. How's it going guys? Lucian Sword here playing some more Breath of the Wild for you guys today as always. Hope you're all having a fantastic day wherever you guys might be. We are continuing our journey and I think that... Ooh, wow, I have a lot of good bows. I see a golden boy down there. I'm interested in killing him, but I actually do want to do some other stuff. So let's take a look at our adventure log. There's a lot of EX treasure that I, I want to get. Um, there's also a bunch of shrine quests. There's, there's such a, just so much that we can do in this game. So I want to focus on these for now. And I noticed that a bunch of these have Deya Village Ruins uh, for like the marker. So I think the Deya Village Ruins are like right here. Yeah. So I want to I wanna go take a look over there. Also, I know that there's a shrine right here at the Dueling Peaks. This one's on the bottom level, but I also know that there's a shrine at the very top on this level, like way up here. So let me let me show you better on this this viewpoint. So see the dueling peaks way up there. There's one shrine that's down below, but there is one that's way up top. I kind of want to try to get to it. Um, it's hard to get to, but. I think we can do it. I think if we blast over there, let's see if I can blast this way. All right, let me put on my climbing gear real quick because we're going to need it. There we go. Sometimes the sorting is kind of weird in this game. And then uh, we're going to go like this. All right, that was actually flawless. <laughs> Better than I thought it would be. Oh, uh, look at that, we have some ore. Oh! It's a big ore. I got a boulder breaker too, this is gonna be easy. Oh, this is a senior. Oh, he's he broke my boulder breaker, man. That was my best weapon. Thank you for the ore. And the master po master sword's power has been restored. All right. The only thing I don't really like about the stone talus is that they don't drop any stone talus specific parts. Like when you kill a Lionel, you get Lionel parts. When you kill a uh, Hinox, you get Hinox parts. And the st the talus is the only other like epic enemy that you fight, and you don't get any parts for that. All right, so now I'm just gonna be climbing up this epic mountain. Um, I don't think there's anywhere where I can do a, a, an easy bomb blast, so we're just gonna do it the old fashioned way and run up. Luckily, I have the full climbing set. Unluckily, I don't have the full set upgraded to level two. I think I need some electric keys wings or something uh, to upgrade the the climbing boots to level two and then I can do uh, jumps like that with like only half the stamina uh, being consumed so I really want to find some electric keys I think Momo said I could find them in the desert area thank you for letting me know that I also think that you can find electric keys in, uh, around Death Mountain, I remember, go and also around the Zora Domain, there was some like in the tunnels. Remember going up the pathway to Zora Domain, there was some. So they're they're around. It's just they're kind of hard to find. But I, I I do remember where they are. So we'll we'll have to go farm some of those. I only need like three of them. Also, guys, today is a huge day in Brawlhalla. So I I was gonna record a Brawlhalla video before this. Um, if Jayun and the Great Sword was out. 
And it is out, but the servers are offline, so I can't really play online, so... That's why I'm doing this, and by the time this video is done, I'll be able to record Jayun and the Great Sword. But, I will say I did play it in training, and it was amazing. That's all I'm gonna say for now. Alright, there it is. We made it. It's a little bit cold, but... Hey, on this beak, we got a Korok, so we're getting a Korok and a Shine. Oh, that's kind of a cute mask. It's kind of like a lily pad leaf. Alright, um, we're just gonna go like that. Dang, I'm too good at this game. Uh, let's, let's jump up here real quick. What, what is this? What is this? Oh, the offering of apples. Who put the first apple up there? Like, dang. Got a Korok seed on each. I know, Link, you're cold. That's okay. Two Korok seeds up here. Alright, let's see what this shrine is. And I wanted to get this shrine also because it's just a cool location being on top of the mountain. Um, in the middle of the map, kind of. You can warp up here, then you can fly like almost anywhere, you know what I mean? Alright, let's see what this shrine is. I have no recollection of what this shrine is at all. I don't remember doing it at all in my previous playthroughs. So... Maybe I'll know once I see it, but... Twin Memories. Ooh. The shrines atop these peaks share a connection. Their memory the answer to the other's question. Commit to memory before you start. Lest a failure, you will depart. Oh my goodness. Alright. I know what this is, and we're not going to be able to even do it. I have to go look at the other shrine to determine where the spheres go. It's pretty crazy. But first, let's go up here. This will actually be a better vantage point. Alright. Or... Or we could just do this. <laughs> Oh, that was so easy, guys. Unfortunately, I didn't get the chest. But we got the spirit orb. I'm gonna have to go back and look at the, uh, the, the other shrine to get the chest. Easiest shrine of my life. All right, let's go back in and do this one for real, though. I, 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 would, I do want to get the chest. All right, so this one's called the She Veneer Shrine. All right. I think this one goes over here. This one goes over here. This one over here. This one over there. And this one over here? Question mark? Alright, let's see what the chest was. Wait, where is the chest? Is there no chest in this area? Where is the chest? Is it up here? It's right there, isn't it, on that ledge? So I could have got the chest without even doing the orbs. Basically on this shrine what you have to do is you have to go to the other shrine on the dueling peaks and take a screenshot. Oh, that's a good weapon. 
and then uh, and then come back. And that's basically what I did, but I took a screenshot with my phone. Alright, so we're good on that. Now I'm gonna go... Actually, we can just go back out and then I'm gonna head towards the uh, Deya Village ruins or whatever. So we can try to get some of these EX chests, guys. I'm really hoping we can get some of these because there's really cool armor and whatnot inside. Oh, this is a great view too. Link's very cold, but that's okay. Alright, so I need to go way down. Way down there. Right? Oh, Link, quit being such a baby. It's actually this way. Get some speed on our jump. Oh, there's another shrine I missed. Alright, let's go back and get that other shrine. A little premature on our launch. That's okay. I forgot. We gotta go get this one too. Let's get this shrine, boys! Two shrines right next to each other. I'm not complaining. This is the, the mirror version of the other shrine, so we just have to line up the balls how they were in the other one. Luckily, I took screenshot of that one as well, so this should be pretty easy. I don't even need to do the orbs, to be honest. I could probably just bomb blast again. Um... Is the shrine is the chest also hidden in the same spot? Yeah it is, so let's just grab the chest real quick. Easy. Not a good weapon. That is not a good weapon. I don't want to drop any of my weapons. So I'm just going to throw that down, pick this one up, okay. We're going to take this one and chuck it, and then I'm going to take back the crossblade. There. Now, we're going to do this. Okay, that didn't work. Fine, fine, I'll do it the old-fashioned way. Um, let's see. This one is going to go like... Alright, I think this one goes all the way over here. Might as well put the orbs in the right spot. At least it'll be like we actually completed the shrine, you know what I mean? I think this is right, but I could be wrong. I think that one goes there. This one goes... There? Got it. Easy. All right. Another spirit orb. Two shrines right off the bat. Easy. Also, guys, I want to use a couple of my amiibos. See if we can get any of those exclusive armor pieces as well. Or weapons. There's, there's, there's a lot of exclusive stuff that we still don't have from the Amiibos. Um, we can only use the Amiibos once per day, so I'm hoping we'll get something good today. I'm not going to use all of them because I have like literally 20-some Amiibos. It takes a while. But I want to use at least a few every episode, you know. Alright, now... Now we can head... Where were we going? That way. And look at that, there's a shrine right there as well. Can't believe we missed that shrine. Alright, here we go. That was a bad one. That was a bad one. 
Probably should have waited a little bit on the second orb. Or second bomb. Okay, let's try that again. There we go. Now, I'm pretty sure the Daya Village Ruins are right under here. Um, let's see. Somewhere in this area. Ow. <laughs> I didn't mean to, I meant to pull out my glider, but. Ooh, wow. That's cool, the giant tree falling over. That's really cool. This is an interesting place. So this used to be a village and now it's completely flooded apparently. Interesting. Probably a lot of treasure in this area, guys, too. Alright. Just so we, uh... Have a little bit of protection while I'm looting this area, let's summon Wolf Link. And, uh... Any minute? No? Why can I not summon Wolf Link here? Okay. And let's let's just real quick use a couple amiibos. See if we'll get anything good. I need the pants of the hero. Ooh, five bomb arrows. All right, that's actually very good. Let's see. We could get Ganondorf's sword. Ten arrows. All right, very useful. Give me the good sword. Oh, we got it. The sword of the six sages are said to have forged this longsword to seal a demon king in the world where the hero fought against the beasts of twilight. The blade shines with a holy luster. Dang, we actually got it. Um. Um. Yeah, I have a lot of really good weapons. Am I really about to drop a great flame blade? Yes, yes I am. This is Ganondorf's sword. Whoa. Cool. Alright, uh, let's do one more. See if we get two for two on the loot. Alright, five fire arrows. The reason I dropped the Great Flame Blade instead of one of these other ones is just, I, I don't like having so many two-handed weapons. And I already got one, two, three, four, five, six, six. Two-handed weapons, you know, that that's enough for me. I don't want so many two-handed weapons. All right, these are the ruins that were spoken of. I'm assuming... Okay, I see a chest way over there. Oh, here we go. There's a journal. Traveling Merchant's Hood is in the right hand of the dragon that consumes the Spring of Courage at Dracozu Lake. The blue garb of the hero is control the wind who travel the ocean where the Minoet River was born. The helm of the King of Shadows is in the swamp of the Valley of Dead Trees south of Dueling Peaks. Evil spirit armor set within Pharaon's Sea of Trees. Find these pieces at the highest of three waterfalls north of Lake Floria at the Brit Holy cow. So, we just got upgrade updates to a lot of different quests, actually. Alright. Let's let's go for this one, I guess. Uh, 
turn on notes, so to speak, but where could he be talking about? Whew. Is there? All right, let's let's explore this place a little bit more. I have a feeling there's more in this village than we have already seen. Actually, let me just use the Master Sword. Another 50 rupees or... Opal, basically, same thing. I did see a treasure somewhere. Now I don't remember where it was. Dang it. Ah, there's one. Alright, let's go get this treasure, then we'll start heading out towards, uh... Some of these EX chests. Oh, this isn't even a treasure, it's just... Okay. Oh, oh my gosh, I'm making it worse. Bad camera. Gotta take a sip of tea. Well, we're making good progress on Koroks and Shrines, I guess. Aha, there is a chest. Not an EX chest, though. Frenic bow? Meh. Only 10 damage? Are you kidding me? This is master mode. Um. The only other thing I wanted to do here. Is go over here. And go up this epic tree. Wait a minute. There's a Korok. Ooh, a fire po. Come on, Korok. Stop moving so fast. There we go. I don't need the fire po though. I don't have any room on my weapons, so. What is going on here? sure what the point of that was. Let's go up this giant trunk. It's so cool. In uh, California, in the Sequoia National Park or whatever, where the redwoods are and the sequoia trees and whatever, there are trees like this um, that I've gone through that are just giant. Let's see. There's got to be something. Oh, the... Dang, he just went straight in the water. Oh wow, is he actually coming over here? I don't think I really need any more rushrooms, TBH. Even though there's a lot of them here. Hey dragon! Wait for me! Okay, never mind. Never mind, I'm just an idiot over here blowing myself up. Oh, a meteor or a fallen star! I just saw a falling star, oh my gosh. Wait for me! I'm coming! I want one of your scales, please! I'm not gonna make it, am I? There we go. 
Aerial Bomb Blast. That's right. No! No! I'm out of stamina! Oh god, I'm gonna die. Not like this. So dang close, guys. That was so close. Oh gosh, I don't want to die down here. I've, I have bad memories in this area, guys. Very bad memories. I need to leave this place as quickly as possible. Wait, my step. Uh. I guess it doesn't count as a death because it doesn't say I died. If you die, it says you died, right? No. Okay, well, we don't need to go to him anyways. Where's that other shrine that was nearby? You remember there was a shrine? Yeah, right there, red, okay. It's actually this way. See you guys. Oh, it's that way. Hard left, hard left. Hard left. Bad hit, bad hit, bad hit. You gotta like line them up just perfectly. Ah. Uh, my square bomb was already out, so it didn't. Yeah. That's alright. I'm starting to get the hang of the bomb launching, though. It's actually so useful once you get the hang of it. You can just get around the map so easily. Ooh, I hear another Korok. I hear it. It's up there. We're going for it. Ooh. Eh, wasted a couple shots, but it's still worth it. 19, alright. Alright, there it is. I should probably heal before I blow myself up again. Might be a good idea. Am I lazy? Yes. Yes, I am. But that's okay. Sometimes... You just gotta bomb blast your way across Hyrule. <laughs> Didn't work. You have to get the bullet time, otherwise it just doesn't work. Is that another Korok? Oh my gosh, it is. So many Koroks in this episode. I think I got more Koroksies in this episode than all the other episodes. This has got to be a new record. What'd I get? Five or six Koroks right here? I mean, it's crazy. Boshkala Shrine. You guys know I'm not going to end... Entering, end the episode, entering a shrine and not complete it. Ow. Hold on guys, hold on. I'll be right back. I just want to do a shrine real quick. <laughs> Funny how it just freezes the enemies right there. Alright, what do we got? The wind guides you. Oh, I remember this shrine. It's like one of the first shrines you're supposed to do, but I must have just missed it. We kind of did go like out and about off the beaten path when we were first starting this game, or this playthrough rather. All right, there's at least one more treasure chest. They're not wrong, the wind is guiding me. What's over here? Nothing? They literally did this for nothing. Just to get back, I guess. Ooh. 
Close. But we got it. Oh, 70 attack? Dang, that's a lot. That is a lot. Hmm. Um. Guess I'm chucking the royal broadsword. I, I like one-handed weapons better, but 70 attack you don't just walk away from. I'm taking it. Holy cow. Easy shrine to end the episode on. That's what I'm talking about. That was close. Actually, guys, we could uh, go get another stamina vessel if we wanted. I think this is our fifth or sixth spirit orb. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Six. That's an awkward posture. Seating position. Just kind of spread his legs all wide like that. Alright, so we did a lot of shrines. We did a lot of Korok seeds. We covered a lot of ground, quite literally. And, uh, but we did also make a little bit of progress on our quest for the EX quest. We didn't actually find any EX. Oh yeah, I did, I did promise these guys I would be back. I don't want to break my promise. I'm back. Thank you guys for waiting so patiently for me. Um, the only thing though, guys, is I... I need to figure out like how to get to those... EX spots. They're like riddles, so we're gonna have to try to find them, I guess. Alright. Um, guess I'm gonna end the episode here, guys. Thank you for watching. There's a lot I could explore around here. I'm, I'm like so tempted to just explore these ruins. Because I never have. Who knows what's there? Anyways, guys, thank you for watching. Please drop a like if you enjoyed. Hope to see you in the next episode. This is Lucian Sword. Take it easy, guys.